This time on XCOM War Stories, the team starts asking the important questions. Some kind of racist one? Oh, here we go. Do you suppose it's part of the psychological warfare of this species to come into battle naked? What? My testicles are sucked up so high up in my scrotum right now, I'm basically a Ken doll. It's freezing out here. Meanwhile, these guys are just swinging in the breeze. What am I looking at? I've got no idea. Well, what do you know, Bradford? Give me some freaking answers. It's super difficult for me to process sarcasm. How seriously are we all taking this extraterrestrial sodomy situation? We take it super serious. You're damn right we take it serious. Because that's XCOM, baby. Commander, there's an incoming message about a situation developing in Baltimore. I see it, Bradford. Is this real? Some kind of test or a hoax or something? We're picking up chatter from local law enforcement communications. Something's going on. We're gonna need satellite or drone coverage from that area. You got a visual? We're working on that, sir. Get this guy Ranger prep just in case. Who's on duty? Uh, Barrera, Boca, Carol, Patterson, Anwar Ramses, and Chris Ruiz. I want those guys in the Situation Room immediately. Get going. Yes, sir. Looks like we're tapped into the Maryland Department of Transportation CCTV network. We got footage from downtown Baltimore. Should be coming up on your screen now. Holy sh! What am I looking at? I've got no idea. Well, what do you know, Bradford? Give me some freaking answers. Well, the boys in imaging seem to have found something here. One of these aliens is sporting a tattoo. Look at this. S-T-L-B sub plus one. What does that mean? These little alien bastards are out there recruiting. We gotta up our game, son. What are you talking about, Commander? I'm at a total loss here. Somehow you are dumber than you look, Bradford. STLB, smash the like button, sub plus one, add another subscriber. It's not rocket science. It means these little alien bastards are recruiting and we better do the same. Please hit like and subscribe. Now let's get to it. Right away, sir. Any of you guys know what we're doing here? No, no idea, Carol. Hey man, like I was told to report into this room. Is this the right place? Oh, <laughs> this can't be the right place, man. Look at this, Patterson. What's up, dude? Say hey, Barrera. What's you up, buddy? You two sit down. We got work to do. Yes, sir. Earlier this evening, we got reports that an alien attack was underway in Baltimore, Maryland. Baltimore? Man, that's exactly what I was going to say. Baltimore? <laughs> they know there was an attack. This cannot be right. Aliens attack New York, Los Angeles, Tokyo, Paris. Buenos Aires, for example. Baltimore? No. Perhaps they've seen the critically acclaimed series, The Wire. We've been collecting satellite footage of the area. You can see it up on the screen. Man, I ain't seen no aliens here. Ring a bell. I see some green. What is that? Like a little spaceship Bombard or something? Stale. Well, hey there. Babe, oh, oh, check that out, man. What is that? Carsetti. Dude, that's not good. That looks like a, like some kind of chemical bomb. Did you say this was satellite footage? How, what kind of satellite is you at ground this, level dude? with people Run, looking back? Run, man. Run. Oh. Weird. Cedric Dang. Daniels. Now. Who else? This is not oh, good. Snoop? I agree with Nacho. Not oh, good. Oh, the heartbreak. Wallace? Do you guys watch oh, no. this show? It was uh, so good. What got him? What, ay, ay, what ay, on ay, earth is going on here? Don't we grab that? that guy, man. What did I just see? Private Ruiz, we don't know why they chose Baltimore. We're confident it's not because of The Wire, despite Omar being a dope character. Regardless, the day that we worried would come has come. Our fight is now. XCOM has been activated. Let's Hell yeah! Yes. Hell so, yeah, man! Bomber, Bomber, gather up your gear and report to the Sky Ranger. The six of you are going to meet the alien threat head on. Godspeed, gentlemen. Good luck. Fellas, report me in here from the cockpit. Here we go, boys. Saddle up. Uh, I am not seeing a place to put her down. Jeez, Louise, you can't. Uh, buildings are a little too tight for the old Sky Ranger. Well, I ain't got the sense God gave a goose. So I'm unfortunately thinking we might have to put it in a little tight in the intersection right in front of the bookstore. 
It's the freaking bookstore. Well, what a great idea, Chuck Yeager. Patterson, that's enough. Is it, Carol? Is it enough for you? Yeah, it's enough. I got an idea there, Chuck Yeager. Why don't you come back here, tone it down, take my gun, not blindfold me, Seriously, pull the pin down. on my grenade, and then kick me out while you fly over the bookstore. I'd probably have a better chance of surviving. Yeah, chill, Holmes. You're getting me freaked ah, out. What? You're not helping, Patterson. Patterson. Seriously, <sighs> chill, Holmes. What? All right, men. First priority, get in the cover as quick as you can. Let's go. Follow me. Hey, yo, boys, we got contact right away. Rooftop, three of them. Looks like one's coming down. You hear, hear that, you glorified bus driver? You happy now? Perhaps we should have brought the Egyptian pilot, no? Well, I thought he was Egyptian. Didn't you hear him talk? No, he sounds nothing he like He sounds him. exactly like you, Nacho. No. What about me, Patterson? You think I'm from Egypt, nah, Brera, I ain't that stupid. Come on, now. I've got a pretty sensitive ear, Patterson. I think he was more of kind of a south side of Chicago kind of guy. Yeah, that's gonna be a bingo for my man Ruiz. Go White Sox, I guess. Hit me up next time you're in Shy. Alright, that's enough, Sky Ranger. Keep this channel clear. Carol, we must avoid being flanked. I'm moving to the other side. Great idea, Boca. Smart. Okay. Nacho, can you move to that left flank with Boca? Yes, I go. But my name not Nacho. Yeah, Make man. A note. Where do you get off calling him Nacho? Uh, I'm confused. Me as well. Wait a second. You're some kind of racist, Holmes? Oh, here we go, Barrera. You're the one that told us to call him Nacho. Yeah, Barrera, you said to do right, it. man, because Ramsey is <laughs> the greatest. It just doesn't sound so good coming out of that corn-fed white boy mouth of yours, Kevin. Uh -huh. <laughs> Barrera. Now, who's the racist now, Barrera? What's racist about calling <laughs> someone a white boy? Shut up, boys. They're on the move. Keep an eye out. I got no visual on them. I'm gonna poke my head out here. Oh boy. What is it? Little freak on the ground is aggressive. I got a shot right now, but I'm Take worried the about the guy all. on the roof. He's got he's got his gun trained right on me. I, I don't know. Gotta pull back. If not now, he can flank he's us. He's right, Carol. You gotta pull back. We gave up the high ground. We let that stupid Sky Ranger pilot drop us off in the middle of this hill. Hey, I heard that. So what do we do? We be patient. We wait for them to leave the high ground. We stay in Yeah, cover. yeah, exactly, man. Exactly, yeah, like... Uh, Carol, what do they even look like, man? Like, what are we up against? Uh, imagine a kindergartner with a head the size of a... Kindergartner? Beach ball, uh, naked. You pick at their junk, gray, appears to be glowing, maybe. What? Their junk is glowing. No, that's not what I said. That's what you're glowing saying. Glowing phalluses? No. Are you serious? No. Is it crazy to hypothesize they, that they'd no. come all this way on some kind of... No. ...sexual spring break? They are glowing. That's crazy. Just freaking look for yourself. It's right behind the cab. Oh, yeah. I can see its glowing little head behind the, the, the cab. You see head of fellas behind the taxi. Uh, I'm not taking any risks here, guys. We're chucking this grenade. Wait just a second. What if they're here for some? Oh, no. Booyah. We got confirmation, boys. Guess we'll never know. They bleed and they die. Nice. First blood to you, Carol. That's all well and good, Holmes. But now their friends are going to know we're here. Nice job with the grenade, Carol. It pains me to say this, but Barrera might be onto something there. I am worried we might get overrun. Yeah, well, first things first. Get your head down. Those guys are still up there. We could take pot shots Carol, at Carol, can you still see them from where you're standing? Or even worse, can they see you from where they're yeah, standing? Yeah, I see them. Oh, crap. Incoming Holy fire. Smokes, Watch out. Carol, pull back, pull back, pull back. What in tarnation was that? The second one's moving that? back into position. I think he's going to fire, too. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, who no. coming? Carol, are you hit, man? Watch it! Carol! Watch it! Patterson, do something, man! Pull him shut back! Shut up, Barrera, before I put the way in your mouth. Get out of the way! I said... You two cut it out. Up. I'm fine. Oof. They seem to be pulling back, though. I'm worried about getting flanked on this other side now. Eesh. They already have the height advantage. He's not good. If these alien rapers come around the flank, they perhaps uh, screw us for real. No way that's happening. I see a big old truck over there. I'm going to try and make my way. Guys, it's, it's super difficult for me to process sarcasm. It, how seriously are we all taking this extraterrestrial sodomy situation? We take it super serious. Better safe than sorry, Holmes. Carol says their peepees glow in exactly, the dark. Exactly, man. Wait, when did I say that? Ne never mind. They're on, the, they're on the move again. Watch out, boys. Carol, you better get your head down. I'm telling you, they're going for that flank. It's just spinning down that flank has to be our top priority. Whoa, what was that? What is it, Holmes? Did you guys feel that? What is it, Carol? <laughs> it was like it was in my head or something. Carol, what are you talking about? What was in your head now? That thing tried to reach into my brain and freak mm. me out. Mm -hmm. mm. Now, Carol, I say this as a friend. Let's not blame the magical alien. This is not good for our own mental failings. Carol going crazy. You're scared. It's fine. 
We're all scared. I'm scared. I am not scared. Gosh dang it, Boca. Of course we're not scared. I'm just <laughs> nah, trying to help man. Carol. Patterson's scared. You can tell. Oh, keep it up, Rare. You'll see what happens. It's so super that we have a squad where we can share feelings with one another. I'm just going to say it. I'm slightly scared. Nothing to be scared of, Louise. These little freaks just got some kind of psychological weapon at their disposal. Plant thoughts in your head. Just be careful. Be ready. They're going to try and get in your head. Hey, man. Maybe that's not such a bad thing. One of these aliens tries to crack you into Patterson's head, they're gonna see some weird stuff, man. <laughs> you ain't wrong there, Barrera. I have seen some stuff in my they time. into Patterson's mind, and all they're gonna see is like the rave scene from the Matrix on a loop. No bad thing. Like, with just with like piece. sweaty hicks from Mississippi or something disgusting <laughs> like that. Exactly. Mama, all those dirty, dark corners of the internet I went to, they served a the purpose. You guys shut up, we got one on the move. I'm taking a shot. Boom! shot. Target down. Nice. Shoot, Tex. Look at that flank. Seems like a stroke of genius. Nice shot, Carol, but it seemed a little lucky to me, man. What? You sound jealous, but at all. Clear the channel. Guys, we got two out of three down. I do not have eyes on the third. Uh, let's take up Overwatch positions. I could hear additional movement coming from inside. I'm expecting additional contacts any moment. Roger that. I was getting sick of hiding behind this green van anyways. I got no visibility on the little pervert. Hey, Carol, I don't want to gloss over one of the things you said. These things are putting thoughts in your head. What kind of thoughts are we talking about here? Man, let's take bets. I'm guessing it's uh, feelings of inadequacy after seeing their glowing junk. We talk about this again? You have an obsession, Barrera? Yeah, he does. It's all he thinks about. They get in his head, all they're going to see is Barrera having intimate relations with one of their own. <laughs> Back to the question. Carol, what did you see? I saw nothing, but I felt like all was lost. Uh, I just wanted to run, at least hide. Then I shook it off. That's such a relief. For a second, I was really supposing it was something so much worse. I've got eyes on the third one. He's on the move again. <clears throat> He's down. Man, Carol, you're a dead eye. Did you guys see that? Unbelievable. Great shoot. He's turning into the Carol show. Come on, guys, we must do something. I'm picking up some kind of radioactive signature from inside the building. You guys getting that? That's a negative over here, Carol. No reading. Copy that, Patterson. Hey, Ruiz, I need you to come over here and help me pin down this flank. Barrera, Patterson, you guys stay put. What the crap, man? Make sure we're not getting overrun in the middle. What the F, man? Snap off a couple of lucky shots, and now all of a sudden you think you're the boss? What you think I don't think? It's not this, Barrera. Is that you're so important. They're so central to everything we do. We need you to hold down the middle. I see what you're doing, Boca, but I don't even mind, man, because it sounds so good. Come on, hombre. We need Like you. all the great battles in history, man, guess what? The center must hold. So guess who's in the middle now? Barrera. And I guess Patterson to some extent, but mostly Barrera. Not cool, man. And I'm going to keep it shush, 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 shush. down. Shush. Oof, I hear something inside. Copy that, Nacho. I'm also picking something up. Keep your eyes peeled. Here they come. They're pouring out of the bookstore, boys. Barrera, you got the shot, man. Take it, take it, take it. Oh, man. Man, that was on purpose, man. Look what happens here. Now they got to go back. They're running back, man. That's exactly where we want them. Where we want them is to be dead, Barrera. Adjust your Ooh. sights, man. Now it's time for me, Ramsey, the Nacho, to show you how we do in Port Said. From the Suez, bitches. Here you go. Mwah. Huh. We Way to go, Nacho. <laughs> Ramses, you really are the Nacho. Thanks. See that, boys? Like, he doesn't make that without me. What are you talking the about? The scraping fire, putting them in their spot. That's what it's all about. That's Barrera right there, hmm. man. Is it, though? That seems like a stretch. It's the kind of thing that doesn't show up in the box score, Holmes. Barrera, I give you credit if you sing with me. Man, I'll sing with you anytime, Nacho. I got a beautiful singing voice. Hey, time out on karaoke. We got more freaks coming in. Still naked, still glowing. Do you suppose it's part of the psychological warfare of this species to come into battle naked? What do you mean? Like, just letting it fly in the wind? I mean, it's freaking March in Baltimore over here. It's freezing. See, it's muy frío aquí. Very, very cold. I mean, my testicles are sucked up so high up in my scrotum right now, I'm basically a Kendall. It's freezing out here. Meanwhile, these guys are just swinging in the breeze. I mean, I'm psyched out. Anybody else? Uh, I'm not sure what to say to that. Ruiz. Uh -huh. Hey guys, I see an opening here. I'm gonna I'm gonna make a run for it. I think we can encircle these guys. I'm gonna try and pin them inside the bookstore. So we're gonna I'm gonna try and push them and flush them towards Nacho, towards Barrera. Keep your eyes peeled. I see some movement. I, I'm gonna squeeze off some rounds. That's a miss. 
Patterson, tell me you see him. You see him? I got that little guy in my sights. Oh man, he's a gall dang Houdini. He dodged those bullets. Unbelievable. Yeah, I couldn't help but notice that you both missed and uh, your little guy, he just ran back into cover. Kind of hard to get him to go exactly where you want him to go, isn't it? Actually, Pereira, I see the one. He's not covered. Ha, that's I priceless. Should. Thank you, Nacho. What I represent. Yes, boys, now we sing. Here we Is go. Is this one, one I'm supposed to sing two, along, man? Three. Oh, Port Said, Egyptian badass, I pull the trigger, I'm alien. Man, is this an Egyptian thing or is this just like a cringe thing? Because I think it's the last one. this song, Holmes. What is this? All right, I'm going to swing in. Whoa, I got one right here. The freak nearly crawled up my butt. Boom. Enemy down. By my count, we got two enemies still up. Let's not get cocky. Keep your eyes peeled. Stick to the plan. Roger that. Pin the cut on. Ruiz here. I'm gonna swing to the outside of this flank. Gonna make sure nobody sneaks up our our keister like that guy almost did before. Man, Ruiz, what's a keister, Holmes? Come on, Pereira, be serious. You don't know what a keister is? Use your context. Even please. the guys from outside the states probably know. Boca, you know what a keister is? Uh, no. What is the keister? All right, what's a keister? One second, boys. I'm advancing. I can see one of these naked little freaks. Okay, okay, I'm in position. Back to the important stuff. What is a keister? It's an old timer word for like, you know, buttocks, the booty, the caboose. Are you like 80 years old you now? Know, oh, your rumpus. Okay. Your tush. In Argentina, we love the keister. Your buns. That ain't just Argentina, Polka. Everyone likes the keister. For that whole is true in Port Said. It's universal. See what I'm talking about, man? I shut up. Clear the channel. Oh, what's wrong, Wonder Boy? You missed a shot. Welcome to the freaking club. Did you set up the perfect shot for your friend? <laughs> Actually, he did, Pereira. Nice job, Carol. Thanks, Patterson. Gotta be kidding me, Holmes. Carol, you are a true ass man. This is the power of the keister. I don't know about that. El culo supremo. <laughs> I do not know what that last part meant. But that is one heck of a call sign. Kulo Suprema. It's the word. Man, oh man. If anyone's even gonna have Ooh. a sweet call sign like asthma, you know it's gonna be me. It's certainly an ass. First of all, I've been getting tail my whole life, man. Anybody knows a thing or two about being an ass man, it's this guy right here. Second of all, where have I been this whole fight? Right in the middle. Hey, Pereira, you. And where's a butt? <laughs> it's like right in the middle, man. So guess what? That's true, the buttock is Just because the guy's from Argentina doesn't mean he gets to make up the nicknames. That's my nickname, man. But didn't you give Ramses a nickname? Oh, Junior's got you there, Barrera. <laughs> I changed my mind. I like Nacho. His good nickname helped me kill aliens. Orle Holmes? Exactly. I'd argue it was not as much the nickname as it was the anti-personnel grenade, but Shut up, I see you get How about this, Barrera? You got one enemy still up. You put that one on its butt, and you will have earned the nickname Ass Man that you so richly desire. This is good contest. Man, what are you, some kind of racist? Do you think I don't think? I'm down. All right. Let's do this. I tell you what I'm going to do, Holmes. I'm going to sit right here behind my little freaking green van. And as soon as that little bugger pops his head out, I'm going to put a bullet straight through his little glowing head. Not if I don't get it first, Barrera. Oh, here he comes. They shot Patterson. Hit that, man. I'm taking a shot, but I can barely see through this smoke. Suck. I missed from yeah. almost point blank range. Just lighting me up. Holy smoke, he's standing right under the open. He's burning on me. You better leave that little freak for me there, Ruiz. Suck like a glowing fat one, Barrera. This one's mine. No sexy time for you, sir. All right, last enemy's down. Let's verify. Clear over here. Clear in the middle. Clear, sir. Patterson, clear. Boca, clear. This is not sure. Clear. Corbot, problem is, it seems like he don't even know I exist. You know how this make me feel? Oh, Mikhail, don't say that. Of course he knows you exist. 
He's written to you in the comments section below. Yes, but why not send David out to Baltimore? If you'd only liked and subscribed the first time you watched one of these videos, perhaps you would have been on one of these early missions. You make a good point, Corbat. You see how it works? Yes, perhaps everyone should uh, click like and subscribe to help XCOM channel grow. Yes. Huzzah for subscribers!